Hi everyone, I have a plan with me for you today. I'm using this bloom kit from Little Miss Papery, which is florally and pastel. So just a disclaimer, I did post plan everything because I didn't bring my planner home for spring break. So just letting you guys know. I'm using some washi tape from Simply Gilded and Pineapple Papery, as well as a U Brands felt tip pen and this permanent marker that's from Taiwan that Marge from Once More With Love sent me. Actually, I went home for spring break and I was so excited because my sister actually went to Taiwan over December and she bought me like 10 of them. So I'm set and I'm so excited about that. Anyway, the first thing that I'm putting down is some washi down at the bottom. Sorry, I should probably silence my phone. And then I'm putting down the glitter headers. These are the fine glitter headers from my shop. I've been really into it lately as opposed to the chunky, but next week I'll probably go back to chunky. Anyway, I used three colors this week and I decided not to alternate them. I guess I wanted to go for a cleaner look. Moving on to the sidebar, I put down a full box that says, Dear Self, You Are Strong. And then I put down some bunny washi that I got from Pineapple Papery, which is adorable. It's a little bunny holding some flowers. I found the washi tape pretty hard to rip, so I just cut it with my slice precision cutter that I got off Amazon. You can also get it at Michael's. As always, everything is linked in the description bar, so if you're curious about where anything is, go check that out. Then I put down a... It's a little things from the kit and I covered the icon up with a house icon from Lily Henry because this week I was home for spring break. And then I put down a happy mail tracker at the bottom as usual and quite a few packages that I was expecting. At the bottom I didn't have anything else to track so I put down another strip of washi and a washi sticker that came with the kit. On Monday the first thing that I put down was a to-do header. And then I put down a little things. I have a question. If I use one little thing sticker, do I call it a little thing or do I call it a little things sticker? Because I always think that little things is just the general name for that kind of sticker, like a skinny sticker with an icon on it. I call that a little things. Anyway, let me know what you guys think in the comments down below because I'm really curious. I put down a today header and then, did I say to do header before because I meant today header? I put down a happy munchkin because I checked my grades and I did better than I thought. I was really worried, so that was a relief. I had a final that was worth 70% of my grades, so. But anyway, on Monday, we went to Chick-fil-A for lunch and then we went to watch Logan. I went with my brother and my cousin. We then got Starbucks afterwards while I got Starbucks for my sister and I. And then I did some laundry. That dainty laundry sticker is from my newest addiction. I also cleaned my brushes. So I used a brushes sticker from Sweet Kwai Design. I did put the she believed she could, so she did full box at the bottom. On Tuesday, Josh came over to visit. So I put that with a couple's munchkin from Once More With Love. And then I put down a to-do header. Tuesday was a super lazy day. We went out for lunch, we got boba, and then we went to Target, which was awesome because I hadn't been to Target in so long. Then I didn't do much in the evening, so I put down a strip of washi tape. And again, Chicago Fire is on on Tuesday, so I put that down. I also remembered that I read The Cuckoo's Calling by Robert Galbraith, aka JK Rowling, and I actually forgot to mark that on Monday. So I pretty much stayed up all night reading that because I'm a total binge reader and a binge watcher. Like if there's a good TV show or a good book, I just can't stop. So that's what I did on Monday evening. And since I didn't have room, I just put an arrow from Chrissy and Designs to mark that. On Wednesday, it was a really good day. I put down a full box for the morning because I slept in. And then I put down a happy day, Kinachi from Kina Prince and a foiled heart from Clever Girl Crafts, which you can't tell from the lighting, but it is foiled. I used a sushi munchkin to mark that I went to get some sushi with my siblings, and then we went to Starbucks afterwards. I used a running shoe sticker from Christian Designs along with a workout sticker that came with a kit because I went for a run that day. My sister and I had some wine and popcorn in the evening. The wine sticker is from Little Paper Prints, and then we did face masks. So I don't have like a sibling sticker, so I just did some sticker surgery with the munchkins to denote two girl munchkins and one boy munchkin to mark 
siblings, like, because I have a twin sister and a little brother. On Thursday, the first thing that I put down was a to-do header, and then I put down a washi sticker with the best friend slash sister's munchkins because my sister and I went to Nordstrom Rack. We got some Thai takeout. The takeout sticker is from Sweet Kwai Design. After that, I went to the city for a hair appointment, and I used a foiled sticker from Planning World to mark that. When I got home, my sister and I did some more shopping. So I used a Today header and another washi strip with a twin sticker from Kina Prince. And then we got some Starbucks along the way. So I used that pretty coffee cup that came with the kit. In the evening, I didn't have much going on, but I did forget to mark my TV show. So I moved that washi tape up and then I put down TGIT for basically The Catch and Grey's Anatomy, which are the two TV shows that I like watching on Thursdays. On Friday, I slept in again, I think, so I just put a full box at the top and the hello sticker that came with the kit. I had to remember to check in for my flight, and then I used a pay bill sticker from Once More With Love. We had a special date night on Friday evening because I was leaving on Saturday, and Saturday is actually Josh's birthday, which I totally forgot to mark in my planner. I'm the worst girlfriend ever but we celebrated on Friday evening. Instead, we went to dinner and then we went and got dessert and beers. And I went to this awesome, or we both went to this awesome shop called Therapy. And I got these two notebooks, which are so perfect. I will Instagram a picture of them eventually, but it was such a cute little shop and I can't wait to go back. So that was really fun. On Saturday, I needed to pack. We actually went to Chick-fil-A at 6.30 in the morning to get breakfast and it was on point. So that was fun. I put a flight info or flight tracker from Crest Press to mark my flight. And when I got back to San Diego, I basically relaxed and caught up on my TV shows. I also finished up some plan with me. So I used a glittery film slate and a record sticker that I made. And then in the evening I had, I popped a bottle of champagne actually to celebrate successfully finishing up winter quarter. And I used a crying emoji at the top there where I had to pack because I was really not looking forward to coming back to school. On Sunday, I cut up a full box to make room for the glitter header. And then I put down a to-do header. I went and got myself some lunch at Lemonade and then I had to make a return at Sephora. That Sephora sticker is from Moonlight Paper Co. In the evening, I binge watch YouTube because I have so many YouTube videos to catch up on and I also had to edit and film another plan with me which is this one that you're watching now so the film and edit stickers are from love for stickers so that's about it for this plan with me I'm just finishing filling everything out I'm sorry that it was so crazy and rambly I think it's because I'm hungry right now so I'm kind of all over the place let me show you the stickers I have left in the kit definitely enough for another spread as usual Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.